Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amir. In this video, we are going to learn how to remove zero from a bar chart in SSRS report. So here you can see that I have data for, uh, so there are two type of data I have here. So I have DB skills and other skills. So the kind of uh, this uh, greenish bar you are seeing, that's for uh, our DB skills and the uh, other dark one is uh, for other skills. So you guys see here, I have uh, one of uh, the other skills for Amir is uh, zero and uh, the uh, DB skills are 100%. So what I would like to do, I would like to remove this part from here now let me show you real quick the data how it look like in the table so i have a name amir 100% zero then i have raza 80% 20 and lisa 50% 50% and then i have robert and there is null value for other skill so if you go back to the chart it's very clear for robert the the data did not show because the uh, other for other skill uh, robert has value null so same kind of trick we are going to play here and remove this zero so now let's go back here that's our chart and uh, how i did create this chart let me uh, just kind of create a new chart in front of you so you would see uh, you're going to go ahead and uh, take a chart here and uh, take uh, sorry this uh, let's take this one a very basic bar chart and uh, now I'm going to go ahead and create this chart for you and then we will implement the removing zero part to it. So first of all, I select uh, DB skills here and uh, that's where our DB skills and next uh, I added uh, to the other skills here. So that's good. And uh, in the category here, I'm going to go ahead and add uh, name. So you guys can see that. Okay, looks good. Uh, just give me a quickly. Now we can uh, execute this uh, report. You're not gonna see all these uh, numbers on top of that because I did not show the labels. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna click uh, right here on this first uh, uh, bar and say show data labels. And then uh, I'm gonna go to the other uh, uh, series here and say show data labels. Now if I will preview my report, I should see the values coming through. So I have 100 here, zero here, because the Amir has zero a value in the database. That's how it is coming. For Robert, we have null, and you guys notice that there is no value here for Robert. So we would like to remove this zero out of that. Let's go to design again, and here we are gonna go to the other skills, and here we are gonna go to the uh, series properties, and here that value is coming. So I'm gonna click on this uh, FX. Uh, so it means I'm going to write some expressions. Uh, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna check uh, if some of this value is equal to zero, then what I would like to do, I would like to just have blank uh, value. So that means it's the same trick I was playing with the null for Robert. See, when it is coming null, it is not showing it. So that's exactly what I did. I said, if uh, my value is zero, consider that as uh, just a blank value here. So otherwise, take the exact value what you have, okay? So hit okay and uh, then uh, hit okay and now we are all good here let's preview the report what i will do i will put this uh, uh, code in the expressions uh, sorry i will put this expression in the detail uh, uh, description of a video so you can copy and paste from there too so you guys see that now the zero is gone so this is how you will uh, uh, end up uh, having your bar report so there are two ways to handle this one Either you handle inside the query and wherever you find the zero just uh, replace with null and that's how you will not see that zero value in your chart uh, bar chart here or other way you write expressions you are going to go to the uh, right here series properties and uh, you're going to go to the value field from where the values come in and here you're going to say check you're going to use IIF if your value is equal to zero, you're gonna replace with the blank and uh, otherwise uh, you have the value simply. So this is the expression you're gonna use it. Thank you very much for watching and I hope this video will help and I will see you guys in next video.